Have you ever had a game of zombies on Buried where you're running about, you've got a really good set of weapons and a really great set of perks, and then all of a sudden you get caught in a swarm of zombies and there's absolutely no way you can get out of it and you get downed and you think, oh no, this is going to be the end of the game. Oh my god, how am I going to survive from getting up? I'm going to have to do something crazily good or get a nuke. But actually, you get up and you get all your perks back except for one and you're like, what the hell just happened? How did that work? Well, in this video, guys, I'm going to be showing you how to unlock the perma perk Tombstone, which is originally in Black Ops 2's Zombie Map Transit, which al allowed you to basically, when you died or when you got down, you'd get all your perks back except for the actual perk Tombstone. And with this, it works kind of the same way with Quick Revive. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show you guys how to unlock this weird but really good perma perk. All right, so the way to unlock Tombstone is... Basically, just to buy four perks before the end of round four it is, I believe. I'm making quick time of this here and just getting to work on round one. This gameplay was sent to me by NoahJ456. If you haven't already, go subscribe to his channel. He's got some fantastic zombie tutorials, tips and tricks on there. A great guy. Fab guy. Anyway, as you can see, we bought our fourth perk and we got the green flash. Now, I think this sticks for around three to four games. It lasts a lot longer than any usual perma perk. And in solo mode, when you get down, the only perk you'd lose is Quick Revive. Now, you can't lose any other perks from that because, of course, if you don't have Quick Revive on solo, you die instantly. But with co-op, you'd lose Quick Revive first and then every perk that you bought first and then kind of like kind of layered them up is what you'd lose. So in co-op mode, I'd lose Jug first, then Speed, then I'd lose Vulture Raid. But that's how the Tombstone perk works. It's been really tricky to actually understand and get find out how this actually worked because I've seen loads of people play Buried, including myself, and we get down and we thought, oh my god, that'll be the end of it. How am I going to survive like in the maze with no jug or anything like that? And then we've got up and we've like, whoa, we've got all our perks back. So I'm not too sure exactly how many matches that the perma perk lasts for, but I know it's definitely not one game because you know I've tried to activate the perma perk myself in other games. And I probably already have it on because I've tested it and after five downs with Quick Revive on solo, I still didn't lose the perk because it was still working. And, it's, and it goes over into co-op mode as well, so it's really interesting. But if you enjoyed this video, guys, and it informed you on how to get this perma perk, then be sure to give the video a like rating. I'm sure that with this perk, you will be able to survive a lot longer in Berry than you usually would. And it will save you a lot of time and points getting those perks back again once you get down. So if you haven't already, do subscribe for more tips and tricks on zombies on Berry. There's a really crazy perma perk that's been found, and I'm not going to post it until I actually find out how to get this, but all I'm going to say is that you can, it's just ridiculous, it's ridiculous, so I'm going to try and work it out as very best I can and bring it to you, if not, I might just show you what it is, and hopefully we can use the community to help find out what it is, but thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon.